It was an immediate, I gotta get there now. There is something I can do. Zach Gandy says the employees of Bar PM called him early Monday morning to tell him the news. He brought both tools and volunteers. Right now we're just literally getting things back to where they can open again. Gandy says his organization, the Rudis Leather Society, calls the bar of safe space. Police say around 12.30 a.m., an officer was heading too close to a parked car and tried to correct himself but lost control of the cruiser, crashing into bar p.m. Chad Morris and James Pence are the married co-owners of the bar who live above it. Police say one of the owners came outside and cursed at officers. When another officer tried to calm things down, police say Morris shoved the officer in the chest. I jumped up thinking it was an accident with a vehicle. And then I seen it and it was a St. Louis City Police Department vehicle in the front of our building. Pence tells a different story. He says he was put into handcuffs first for refusing to give his ID. After that, Pence says the police officers made a homophobic remark to his husband. Came out. My husband came out as well. There was one cop that made a very homophobic remark. My husband did put his hand on a cop out of defense because they had already put me in handcuffs for coming out wanting to know what's going on. I was told I had to ID or shut up. During a Monday press conference, Mayor Tashara Jones commented on the crash. Well, that's still under investigation, and uh, and soon as I have more information, we'll be able to get that, uh, get that information to you as well. Gandhi says helping is the least he can do. Anytime somebody is in trouble and you know you can help them, you want to do everything in your power to get them back up and running immediately. That's just what this community does. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.